Hello, happy Thursday. Welcome to my channel. Um, stick around for a little while. I am planning next week in my passion planner. Um, this is a planner that I won on Instagram and I use it for my word of the day. And then I also use the monthly view for um, something I learn each day. I, I was using it for gratitude, but I'm kind of doing a gratitude challenge um, right now. So I'm doing it in a different manner, but I always, um, I really fell into liking um, not just what I'm grateful for, but um, something I learn each day. So, let's see, and this will be, this next week will be my, um, so this is how I do my monthly. Um, it's all decorated, and then each day I go through and um, write down something I learn each day. And then I always come here to the week. Um, I write little memories and things in the boxes. Um, there's always a quote over here on the left. And, um, and then I do my word of the day and the definition. And then I also do a translation. I do Spanish and um, I, ha I translate that word of the day into the Spanish word. Um, I'm hoping it will kind of um, grow on me and maybe I'll learn a few S Spanish words, but they'll probably be so um, advanced, like some of these words are really advanced that I don't normally use. You know, if I use these words in Spanish, they probably would think I'm crazy or not know what they're talking about. But anyways, so that's this week, but um, so I am planning next week, which is my birthday week. And I am using a mishmash of um, fall things. Um, you know, that's my main one. This is a, um, it's just a partial kit that I got like in a grab bag. And it's by DEK Designs Fall for Fashion. And then I just pulled some fall samplers out that I'm going to pair it with. Pull out some fall colored quarter boxes, half boxes, um, some headers from Genevieve Studios, um, some important boxes from, um, gosh, what does that say? Paper Focus, that's what it says. So important boxes from Paper Focus. I also pulled out my samplers from Oh Hello Stationery because there's always little goodies, um, bucket list things that I can put in. And then this week coming up, I am using um, pretty much like gold washi from Simply Gilded, as well as this navy washi, and then another sampler that I got that has some gold bows on it. And then just some, you know, gold accents. Those are from that Happy Planner, DEK Designs. These are from the Happy Planner teacher book. I believe it's the teacher book someone gave me. Um, just some checklist, noted stickers, some gold headers. These are from the journaling book. Um, Planning City stickers. And then I usually use um, like a gold overlay on these when I use them. And then some, some bows that I can put at the top, bow headers. Uh, <clears throat> so anyways, just using bits and pieces this week. But first, I, I usually um, lay down my washi. I don't use a lot of washi when I um, plan, but I use a little bit. Um, I don't work right now other than doing some mystery shopping, so I always cover up the work to do and But I've It's kind of been hard for me to video this week. I um I'm, I'm having a really high pain week with my joints so um it's just really hard to sit up and do a lot of things. It's better for me when I keep my legs elevated. But 
but and then you know things are really stressful for us i don't know if you if i've mentioned that greg um his store that he was working at this year's that he was working at closed so um about two weeks ago so he's been unemployed and is looking for work um unemployment has been delayed three weeks so um we are both just really um, kind of stressed. Um, we have like zero income right now. And right before he, he was done working, we had to do $1,500 in repairs on our car. And now we have a flat tire. Um, so it just, um, it gets overwhelming and it gets discouraging. But I know we'll, we'll make it through. It's just, um, I'm a very positive person and I don't know. Today's just been a really hard day. Part of that is because um, it was very cloudy and dreary outside. And that has a tendency to get me down because I have seasonal affective disorder. Um, I need sunshine. I just absolutely do. It makes me feel better. It makes me feel more positive. And um, I literally, I, you know, people complain about you know, getting too much sun and, you know, it causes skin cancer and blah, blah, blah. I need it. I need the sunshine to soak up. And I also have um, a lot of vitamin deficiency, so my body craves it. Um, so it's it's kind of hard for, for me right now. But I'm trying not to get down and I keep myself planning and crafting so I... Um, you know, this time together with Greg has been awesome. So that always helps. Um, okay, so I laid down some washi, just really simple. And then I'll probably come over here and lay down just a little more washi. Just on these two headers over here. I've been trying to stay busy with them, um, planning and crafting and doing mystery shopping and and those kind of things. But then we get a flat tire and it kind of throws a, a glitch in things, a glitch that we really didn't need right now. Yeah, I don't know how unemployment expects you to live without income at all. You know, like, like what are people supposed to do? Okay, we'll just stay at home without any food or anything until, you know, you decide to send us a check. It's just, um, I don't know. Crazy situation. I'll probably write, like, a positive word in here to help my outlook for next week. But like I said, Monday is my birthday, Monday the 18th. And I'm certainly not ashamed to say, but I'll be um, 47. Um, so. I had to make the tough decision today when I was scheduling some mystery shopping jobs to um, whether or not I wanted to actually schedule some on Monday for, um, even though it was my birthday. Because we need, we need the money, we really do. And so, but it's just gonna have to wait a day. I decided that I am, I'm not working Monday. And then after I lay down my washi, I usually go through and lay down some decorative stickers. I'm much more decorative in my um, word of the day planner, as you can see, because sometimes it's very simple. Other times I write more. A lot of positive quotes, things like that.
But this is just something, you know, word of the day and something I learn each day. And it's very important to me to um, keep my brain active, even though I can't use my degree now and and um, and I'm not working. It's still important to me to, um, to stay as active as I can and keep my brain to get smarter, I guess, pretty much is what I do. We have to kind of rein it in sometimes because you, you don't want the guys to realize how much smarter you are than they are and things like that. Greg's over there on his computer. I don't think he heard that statement. But that's all right. Hey, I, I mean, this is pretty much a proven fact. I mean, I think. You're only smarter than me <clears throat> when it comes to the female origin. <laughs> I want you to go out there and I want you to saw three quarters of an inch of wood without measuring it. Yeah, you know I could. As long as I got my iPhone, I can Google anything. <laughs> so I kind of laid down um, some of those decorative boxes. I don't want to overdo it, so I, um, I kind of alternate it. <coughs> this one says cultivate the habit of being grateful for every good thing that comes to you and to give thanks continuously which is something that's very important to me I'm trying to live my life um, deeper in gratitude and grace um, I think that's all those I need and so Let's see. I'll put a couple of these on. Sometimes I put the little gold headers at the bottom. I don't know. I just mix it up. I don't like things matchy-matchy. And, um, and so I just play around with it. I mean, this planner right here, nobody sees it except when I video right here. But, um. not one I share all the time, so. Yeah. Some of them won't come off. This is a, one of the oops bags that I got from, I believe, DEK Designs. So, a couple of them are really hard to get off. of these little headers. I've never really 
seen any like this, but it just adds a little to your page. And then I always put some of these noted ones and I will put them up there and I will write the actual word of the day. Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. I got four of these so let's start out on Monday. But they're a little bigger than the box so I want to center them. Then I put the word of the day and underneath it I put my definition and then I'll put another little sticker and it is for um, the Spanish word of the day. So one of these times if you come back to my channel and I'm doing a video in Spanish, don't mind me because although McGregor says I'm not smarter than him, um, I will be the one speaking Spanish. Please, Snobby Doc, beat that, baby. Yeah, whatever. Whatever. Please, Snobby Doc. How about Comprenis? I'm pretty sure Feliz Snobby Doc is not. Is it Spanish? Yes. Oh, what's that? <laughs> we didn't have that yet on the word of the day. Ah, uh, Comprenis? Whatever. Don't that, say bad words. That means, <laughs> that means excuse me in Spanish. Um, la chuga. Lettuce. Oh, only you would know the word lettuce. Who needs to know the word lettuce? Well, I guess if you want on your tacos, that's quite important. But. Queso. Cheese. Yeah. Oh, well, I used to work at Taco Bell, so. The rest are dirty, so I'd rather not say. See, I told you he knew all the potty words. All of them. Okay, so there is that. I'm gonna put a little bit, a couple of these down here. Then I will use like these right here. I have one, two, three, four, five. So I have enough and I will use those um, after I write the definition for my word of the day. Then I always put a sticker and I use it for the Spanish word of the day. So I will just keep those folded right in there. And I think that's it. It's pretty simple in my... um in my passion planner. Um, I'm ready for next week. And in case you're wondering, Monday is my birthday. Feel free to send happy mail. Um, I have no problem with that whatsoever. Mail lady does not like me in November and December because I do get so much happy mail from family back home and friends back home, but oh well, she'll get over it. And somehow, don't ask me how, I have no idea, but I had a package delivered to me even on Veterans Day. And the post office was totally closed. They were not supposed to be delivering packages, but I got lucky. 
So anyways, this is my week in my um, passion planner for my word of the day. Like I said, it's more decorative for me. And then I will go in and write, either put positive quotes in here or write word of the day, things that are inspiring, that kind of thing. Because Lord, I need it right now. So, um, so have a wonderful Friday tomorrow um, and a wonderful start to your weekend. And um, I will be back soon with my next um, playing with me. Have a wonderful night.